Panda Brada Nada Baza Brande Bedeha Zima Brada Banana Bazante Brede Bedeha Zima Branda Baza Kapale Brende de Deha Zebranda Bazaka Pande Brede Bazanta Lalabaha Zebranta Lelebaha Zabranta Balebaha Lembrin Kapanda Brazanta Lelebaha Kapande Brede Deha Oh Jesus You alone are worthy of God Zebranda Bazanta Pale Brede Bede Deha Zebranda Mene Mene Mazanta Lalabaza Zabranda Palava Braza, Cantanta Brada Badada Baco, the Bruno Bosom, the Breda de Ha Zemrene Menemene Mazanta Lava Baba Baba, the Brada Bazanta Brada Badada Babrada Bazanta Breda Badada Ha Zemrene Menene Mazanta Lava Baba, Zabraka Papa, Zeman Canto Brandi Breda Beda Beda de Ha Zemrene Menemene Mazanta Lava Baba Baba. Zebranda Brada Bada Babra Zanka Papaya, Lebrenda Brada Bazanka Tonto Brada Pa, Lebrenda Zanka Panta Brada Baba, Zebranda Palava Zonto Brati Vidiha, Lebrenda Menemene Menene Mazanta Lava Baba Baba Java, Rabada Babrada Bazanka Panta Brada Baba Baba. Zemrene Mazan Kantan Talala Baba, Rabada Bada Bada Bazan, Devada Bada Baba, Baba, Shaba Bada Baha, Rabada Bada Baba, Bazan Kantan Talala Baba, Zemrene Menemene Mazan Tabada Bada Baha, Rabba Kum Tom Tom Ran Devada Deba. Zemrene Menene Mazan Tabada Baba, Zeba Kum Tom Tom Ran Devada. Zebren kapan tabra da bada da bah, zebren tabel bra kapan do zebren da bada da ha, zebren tabel ba bra zong kum tum to bra da bada da ha, zebren da bada ba bra zeng kan tan tabra, zebren da bala ba bra kapan da bada da ba ba, zebren da bala ba bra zong kum tum to bra da da ha. Zebran tala la ba 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 zaka ba ya. Zebran tala la ba 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 zaba la ba ha. Ra ba 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 kapa 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 dabra la ba ba. Lebran tala la ba 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 zaba. Ra ba kapa dabra la ba la ba zan dabra la ba ha. E ba le ba bra zaka ba kan tum dabra la ba. Lebran tala la ba zan kan tala la ba ba zaba. Zeman lebran la ba 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 zaka ba ra ba la ha. Lebran tala la ba 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 zama kun da ra ba da za. Zebran tala la ba ba zan kan tan tala la ba ha. Zebran la ba zan kan tala la ba 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 zebran la ba ya. Zebran kapan kun tum tum bran di 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 ba ba. In the name of Jesus, God bless you so much for joining me. Today it is by the grace of God and it is by the message of God. It is by the grace of God and it is by the message of God we are all alive and we have not been consumed. Amen. So I thank you also for joining me. I will advise you or I will request of you to share to friends and family so that they also can be a part of this amen so that they can also be a part they can also be a part of this they can enjoy the prayer and um and and the grace of god will also be extended to them in the name of jesus amen before we start prayer i want to um admonish you a little bit do you remember the woman with the issue of blood the woman with the issue of blood. The woman with the issue of blood. Le brada zan kan tala la baha. Zaba le branda daya. Jeke banda za brandi bidi ha. Just continue to share. Just give me a minute. As I share this myself. Because I'll also share it. So I'm also sharing this. I'm also sharing this. I'm also sharing this. Le kata branda baha. Zembranda bakato zerebedehe imapa la rabados sakanta rabadadaha lebra zankanta la la baba ba jamabranda baba zemankanta branda balababa 
in the name of Jesus. Um, the woman with the issue of the blood, the Bible says that for 12 years she has been bleeding. And you know, there are various and dimensions to this text, revelations uh, and, and whatnot. But let's assume that this woman had come to the place of, of, of weakness. She's anemic. So, so she gets cold easily. She gets tired easily. You understand? And the Bible says that she went and pressed through the crowd in order to be able to touch Jesus. She pressed through the crowd to be able to touch Jesus. So imagine that there were thousands of people around Jesus or perhaps maybe 500 people or maybe 200 people. We can't really count because the Bible says that multitudes of people. So if we are saying multitude of people, that means that there is a lot of people that had what? That had surrounded Jesus. But the Bible says that she pressed through. That means that there was a resistance. You don't push through if you have easy access. Am I making sense to you? You do not what? You do not push through if there is what? Easy access. So that means that there was a resistance to this woman being able to get to Jesus to what? To now touch the hem of his garment. Am I making sense to you? It is the same way with prayer. You have to push through. There are resistance. There are forces that will resist your prayer. That will resist you from praying. There are circumstances and situations of that has been orchestrated from the pits of darkness, uh, designed specifically to distract you from being able to pray. You understand? So you have to be determined. The Bible says that this woman said that, let me go and perhaps if I touch her, the hem of his garment, then guess what? Then maybe I will be healed. So this woman had been in the situation for a very long time and she what? She was tired of being tired. She said, enough is what? Is enough. I am tired of being tired, of being tired. I'm sick of being sick. Am I making sense? Sometimes we have to get to that place of being tired, of being tired, of being sick, of being sick. Uh, uh, everything, it, it seems as if it picks up and then everything slows down. You have a good day today, tomorrow, something happens and then calamity and calabash, boom, everything falls down tired of being tired and she pressed through so today we are going to press through irrespective of the resistance that the enemy is bringing our way am i making sense to you the bible says that what submit yourselves therefore to god resist the enemy and he will flee away another verse said resist him steadfastly so we are going to resist him in prayer hallelujah in the name of jesus Lift up your voice and begin to now pray in the Holy Ghost. Uh, begin to build your spiritual capacity. Begin to stir up yourself in your most holy faith. Trust me, I have a sweet word of God for you today. When I woke up this morning, the Lord dropped some words in my spirit that I want to share with you. But I want us to pray and get ourselves prepared and ready in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice up. Begin to pray in the Holy Spirit. Lembrana mazan kanta brada baha, zebranda bazan kondo brada babaya, zemene brenta le bazan kanta brada baha, zebrana baba bazan kanta la la babaya, ima kapanda brazan tala baba ba, lembrende bazun tabrada ha, yama branda bazan kanta la baba ba, yama na mazon kondo to bradi bri apa ya, lembrende bado zebakunda rababa, yebele branda. Zankan Talalabaha, 
Ibranda bazen kantelele baha. Ibala brando zonto brada baha. Ibale branda bazen kontonto bra. Reba kondo brada bazante bedeha. Imale branda bala baba baja branta dala baha. Ele brada babra zan kontonto brada baha. Ibrande bazen telele baha. Ibale brande bazun kurba dala baha. Ibrande mene mazan telele bapaya. Le branda bazan kontonto brada bapaya. Ibrande bele Brezen kundo brada baha, e brada badi mazon do brada bede deha, e mama kapa pan kan ton tolele ba, e brada bada mazan telele ba, e brada brezen kan talala papa ya, e brada bada mazon kundo do brada baha. Come on, pray in the Holy Ghost. Come on, stir up yourself in your most holy faith. Begin to speak in another language. Begin to pray in the Holy Ghost. I ke le brende zele baha, I ke le brende le mazun darabaha. I can le brandi briando zarabadaya. I can branda bala bazun de le baha. Le branca pangondo rabadaha. I male branda bazanta ya le bele brezen kondo brada da ha ya branda bazanta le le ba ha ya bele bele be branda brezen kondo brando so ya le branda bala bazan kanta le le ba ha le branda ba bazan kondo kondo brada da ha ya mrede mazanta be le ba ha ya branda ba 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 ya branca pa ya rabala ba 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 zon kondo kondo brada ha ya branda ba da da ba da da bazan kanta be le le ba ha le branda be da be ba ba kondo le le Baba, le baba, 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 ya branda bala, rabanda branda bazan kanta le le baha, ya branda bada da ba kaban gondo branda baha, le branda branda bazan le le baha, ya branda bala bazon do branda bada da baba baba ya branda baha, ya ka branda bada zan de branda ha, ya branda bazan kanta le le baha, ya bala branda le le baha, ya branda bada bada da baba da ha, ya branda bazan le le baha, ya rababa baba ya branda baha, ya branda Branda bazan kan ton to ba ya, ya branda bela branda bazon to branda da ha, ya branda branda ba ba bazan to le le ba ha, ra ba 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 ya branda ba ha, le branda bela ba bazon kon ton to branda ha, ra branda branda ba da da ba ha, ya branda ba da da bazan to le le ba ha, ra ba da ba da da ba branda bazan to le le ba ha, ra ba da da ba 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 ya branda ba ha, ra ba ba ya branda ba ha, ra man kon ton to branda ba ha, le branda ba da da ba branda ba ha, ra man to Rabba 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 I branda da ya, ya branda bazun da ya, i ka branda ba 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 ha, ya branda bazan da branda ha, i ka ba branda balos da branda ha, i meke branda bele bazan da da ha, ya ka branda ba ba zan da da ha, ya branda ba 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 jamna na ba ha, ya branda ba ba zan da ya, ya bele bele le ba branda ba da da ba ha, ra ba 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 jam branda ba ha, ra ba 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 jam branda ba ha, ra ba 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 jam branda Rabba 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 Rab
and we are still praying don't worry it's still prayer i'm trying to hold it back so that i can share it later but i, I just have to release it now remember when the bible said that the spirit of the lord was hovering over the face of the earth the Spirit of the Lord was examining the earth to see what was happening. The Bible says that it was dark and void and it was not according to the taste of God. It was not pleasing to God. It was not what he desired. So when God saw everything that was happening, guess what God did? God did not go and complain to the angels. God did not go and complain to Jesus and the Holy Spirit, but the Bible says that he opened his mouth and he said, let there be light. And there was light. Do you know that you have the power to create your own environment? See, whenever you are in an atmosphere and you don't like that atmosphere, the atmosphere is not conducive enough for you to be able to pray you have the power to create that atmosphere you have the power to change that atmosphere that same spirit uh, that god uh, released to to, to to who fought the face of the earth is that same spirit that dwelled within you and the words of god was let there be light so wherever there is darkness in your area you have the power to declare let there be be light and guess what the bible says and there was light why because god has spoken the bible says see that prophesy must prophesy, prophesy as if god is prophesying he that preaches must preach as if god is preaching now the bible says he calls those things that be not as if they are i don't know who i am speaking to right now i don't know whose mood is down i don't know whose atmosphere is not conducive enough for prayer but you you possess the power to what to change that atmosphere am i making sense to you your body might be icky tired your mind all of a sudden might be experiencing confusion or whatnot but you have power to speak to your soul rejoice ah uh, for this is the day that the lord have made uh, let branda rise up uh, and begin to bless the name of the lord come on lift up your voice and begin to bless him david said uh, i will bless the lord at all times uh, and his praises shall continually be in my mouth uh, can somebody lift up their voice uh, and begin to bless the lord uh, somebody lift up their voice uh, and begin to give God the glory. Somebody lift up their voice and begin to give God the praise. Begin to exalt him. Begin to glorify him. Begin to magnify the name of the Lord. For he alone is worthy. For he alone is mighty. For he alone is glorious. For he alone is magnificent. Oh, from the rising of the sun to the going down of the same, his name is to be hallowed because he is Adonai. Because he is Adonai. Adonai, because he is El Shaddai, because he is Elohim. Ah, la rabada zabakapa, ramama mazanta brada baha, ya brada bapapa, ya mabranda bazunta baha, ika branda bazanta lele baha. Come on, lift up the name of the Lord. Lift up the name of the Lord. Lift up the name of the Lord. He is worthy. He is mighty. He is glorious. He is magnificent. He is mysterious. Oh Lord, my God, how wonderful are your works! How wonderful is your name! How glorious is your name! How magnificent is your name! You are Rabadazaba. You are over all. 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 Imrana Mazanta Laba, Yakata Labrande Breda. The same yesterday, today, and forever. You change not of oh God the Alpha through to the Omega we bless your holy name we glorify your name we magnify your name you alone you are worthy you alone you are worthy Ramanda Zande Brede Bakunda Rabazunda Lebaha 
ya malabranda zangontonto le baha ya brada bada da bazante le le baha e kabranda na bazante le le ha le brande bazunda le le ya kabrada bada bada ha i branda ba ba bazante le le baha i brana mazangontonto brada ha rebele brande brade baha ya brada ba ba bazante le le ha i kabranda bala ba brazondo do brada da ha ya kabrande bele brazondo do ba ha ya brande bele brande de de ha i man don do robo do ya brande be de be de de ha i brande be de brange de be de ha i bringi digi di bringi digi di ha ra pa 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 i embrana mazunda na ba ha ra ban kon don do brada ka ha ya brande be de papa ya we give you praise of god we give you glory jesus we give you glory li ra ba da zondo ya le branda ba le brazanda da ha ya ka ba da brazanda da ha ya ba la ba da da ba da ha ya ba da ba da da ba ha i branda ba la ba zonda le le ba ya ba na ma na na ma zonda be de ha i branda ba da ba zonga ndo be da ha ya brandi be de ga ba branda branda ndi re ga ba ya ya ma na ni 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 ando ro ba zonga ndo ro ko ro ngo do re da brungu do be ri andi be ri abando ro ba gondo ngo ro ba go gongo re ba gondo go gongo le be de be de ba zonda be de ha in the name of jesus the bible says that if we regard iniquity in our hearts god will not hear our prayer i want you to lift up your voice and 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 ask for forgiveness plead for forgiveness of sins the bible says that if we confess our sins unto him he is faithful and just to forgive us and to cleanse us from all our righteousness lift up your voice and begin to pray and ask god the lord any sins of omission any sins deliberate sins ignorant sins i pray that god by your mercy you forgive me in the name of jesus Jesus, li karada bazumne meneha. The lies are then told. The 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 offenses that I've held in my heart. The bitterness, oh God. The jealous, the unforgivenessness. Lord, today I pray that you have mercy on me. You forgive me in the name of Jesus. Rabaduze de meha. Remeni hadum guri abanda. Lemrani mini azunda rabade. Li ri abaru. Runda rabazunda, le kiri abaluru mana madonde, le karaba donzo mani mi apa, ye breni mini abaluza rebadaha, ya kura bada bazungu rubadinga, le kunde rege de ginge de bagurna ndazanda, ya branda bazondo ya. Come on, lift up your voice, and as you are pleading for forgiveness, I want you to plead the blood of Jesus. Begin to wash yourself in the blood. Begin to cleanse yourself in the blood. David said, "Wash me, and I will be washed. Cleanse me, and I will be clean." Lift up your voice and pray the Lord. Wash me in the blood of God. Cleanse me in the blood, and I will be clean. In the name of Jesus, by the blood, by the blood. Lebrana mazunda raha, reba kuma raba dada ya, yebele brende bele bazunda reba ha, imanton to le bakunte le baza, le bakunte nte le babrada ba ha, yebele brese. I plead the blood of Jesus. The blood that speaks a better word than that of Abel. The blood that is spotless without a wrinkle. The blood of Jesus. Libranum andi riadosaya rekebe el yabando rabakaya libri anta la branda da ha la branda bela ba ha reba ba ba zangondondo reba kuma mama zande de de ha. Ibadiha, ribaba, yemene mrende bazonda brada ha, lebrende brende brada ha, ika branda baba bazanda brada ha, lebranda baba ba ha, yaka branda bada bazonga ndondo ya, lebrende bele brazonda ba ha, imrana makapa, lebrende brende ha, ike bele brende bele ba ha, lebrando zonda brada kapa ha, ibrende bede brende le ba ha, rababando zanda ya, ika bale brando 
Zonda Zonda Daha, Yaka Brenda Bede Branda Daha, in the name of Jesus, lift up your voice right now and begin to pray for fresh anointing, begin to pray for fresh grace, begin to pray for new messages. The Bible says that his message are new every morning. David prayed a prayer, he says, The Lord, exalt my horn like that of the unicorn, anoint me with fresh oil. Come on, lift up your voice and pray for strength. I need strength. Lord, strengthen me that I may be able to continue in this journey of prayer. Kabrada Bazaha, Kabrada Bazata, Kabrada Balebaha, Kabrada Bazunde, Kabrada Bakonende, Kabranda Balikudia, Ikuri Apaduza Lebeha, Liki Brianta Labrazuna Namaha, Lebrande Bedi Capando Robo, Ribaba Bazantaya, Lebrande Belebrando Zondo, Yaka Brada Baha, Imana Brazanta Labaha, Imrana Mazanta Labaha, Lebrada Baba Baha, Rababa Baha, Lebrazan Cantala Baba Baha, Rababa Baba Baja Branda Baha, Lebrada Baba, Lebaba Jababraha, Lababa Baja Baba, Rababa Baba Baja Baha, Lebabra Baba Jaba, Lebabra Jababa, Lebaba Jababa Kapaha, Rababa Baja Baba, Rababa Baba Jaba, Lebaba Baba Jaba, Rima Mazan Cantala Baba, Rababa Baba Zantala Baha, Raba Kondo Brada, Imrana Mazanta Deha, Yabranda Bedeha, Ike Brenda Badia Zuya, Lebrana Mazanta Deha, Yabrada Baba, Rima Mamma Zandaya, Lebrada Baha, Raba Baba Bajaba, Laba Baba Jababa, Laba Baba Jaba, Raba Baba, Rima Kondo Brada Baha, Raba Baba, Raba Baba Zanta Labaha, Leba Brazanta Labaha, Raba Baba Zanta Laba, Leba Brada Bajaba, Raba Baba, Leba Brazababa, Leba Brada Baba, Laba Baba Jama Contabra, Lebra de Baba, Raba Baba Kapa, Le Mazanta Laba, Leba Baba Jaba Brakapaya, Ibarra Bada Zanda, Imbrana Macopaya, Lebra de Beconto Doria Paya, Fresh Oil of God, Fresh Grace of God, Imbrana Mazuya, Lebra de Bedeha, Yaraba Baba, Yaraba Baba, Yaraba Baba, Yaraba Baba, Yaraba Baba, Ikomrana Mazanda Leba Brazon. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. We are praying. We are praying. The Bible says that the woman, the widow, continually went before this dead. That means that this woman was in desperation. This woman needed a change in her situation. This woman needed a change in her circumstances. See, it is only such desperation that will cause a man like Blind Matthias to scream on top of his voice when he heard that it was Jesus that was what that, that was that was passing by. It is only such desperation that can cause a woman that has been bleeding for 12 good years to decide to step out of a comfort zone to come and face the shame of the public, to come and, 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 and face the scrutinization of the general public, the criticism of the general public. Do you know how shameful it, it was it would have been? for that woman uh, to come out of her house just because uh, she needed to touch Jesus. She risked her life uh, to be in the public because there was a law. There was a law that stated that such a woman must not be amongst the general public because anything she touches is unclean. Liba rabado zemrende de ha. Zebrenka papa pa. Zemrende bede de bekepe. Ikri kitiki ribidi apandore papa pa. Lebrende bede brianta la papa. Pray in the Holy Ghost for a minute. Limbra na makunde rebete tete. Ribandoro bozuka rabada bakupanda da da. Zebrende bele bakunto rabatata. Yebrende bele brazi kepete tete. Libri antoro bada zuku pandi briha. 
rebe konto reba biandam brundo doda ya pale pa leke brende beha increase oh God my capacity come on pray right now that pray and tell God to increase your capacity for prayer increase my capacity for prayer increase my capacity for prayer increase my capacity for prayer le brendo sika i brende bazu le mrana mazunda le le branda ba kondo rabaha e mabranda maze le branda ba 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 ya branda ba zondo le ba ya ke brende ba ha i pa le brende ba zum kore ba da ya ya mrende ba 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 le ba ba ha ra ba 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 le ba 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 le ba 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 le re ba 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 le ra ba 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 increase oh god my capacity for prayer in the name of jesus now for our next prayer point, I need us to examine something here in Exodus chapter 3. Exodus chapter 3. Oh, praise God. Lima da braza bale brandaha. The Bible says that, verse 1, read it from verse 1 through to 3 and we will jump to another verse. The Bible says that now Moses kept the flock of Jethro his father-in-law, the priest of Midian, and he led the flock to the backside of the desert and came to the mountain of God. Somebody said the mountain of God. Oh, how I want to climb the mountain of God and make my abode on that mountain of God. La rabakon dobre debeha. Even Horeb. Verse 2. And the angel of the Lord appeared unto him in a flame of fire out of the midst of a bur- uh, out of the midst of a bush and he looked and behold the bush burned with fire and the bush was not consumed ah male bradabaha i can't wait to the day that god will decide that he is going to descend down in the fire and we will be gathered in the sanctuary praying and then we will see a ball of fire sitting on top of the altar and it is burning but it is not being consumed ah malaria there are some people that may say those times are past but no 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 the bible says it's the same yesterday today and forever my god is verse 3 and moses said i will now turn aside and see this great sight why the bush is not burnt the curiosity that the Lord enticed his curiosity, if I should say, for him to draw closer so that he what that he will be able to now have that encounter. Now let's move on. We know the story already. You know the story already. So the Lord described and met him, he spoke and all that. And then verse 10 says that come now, therefore, verse 10. Verse 10. He says that. Come now, therefore, and I will send thee unto Pharaoh, that thou mayest bring forth my people, the children of Israel, out of Egypt. So God came and was talking to Moses, and he said he has heard the cry of his people, and this and this and this and that and that. But now, Moses, you are the one I am going to send to go and rescue my people. My my, my prayer point is short. It is through this encounter that Moses was able to discover his purpose, his mandate. You are born for an assignment. You are born with a purpose. Many of us, our life is in shambles because we don't know our purpose. We don't know our assignment. I want you to begin to pray right now. The Lord, show, excuse me, the Lord, show me my purpose. 
Lord, show me my mandate in the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice and begin to pray right now. That Lord, Libra Namazandeya, reveal to me my purpose. Reveal to me my assignment in the name of Jesus. I don't want to make a, I don't want to make a shipwreck of my life. I don't want to waste my years on earth and not walk in my purpose and not walk in my assignment and not know why I am here on earth. Lift up your voice and begin to pray that God reveal to me, that God reveal to me, that God reveal to me, reveal to me my purpose, reveal to me my assignment, reveal to me my destiny in the name of Jesus. Ibra da bazundo rebaha, raka pale bali bali balozo, yamra na mama mazande deha. Come on, pray. Le branda bazondo le baha. Ya kapali branda bazunde le baha. I branda bakapa. La branda bazande le baha. Lord Jesus, in this season, in this time, reveal, O oh God, to me my purpose, O oh God. Reveal unto me my assignment. Show me, O oh God, which way I should go. Direct my path. Lead me. Lead me by your counsel. Lead me by your words. Rakata, rakata na baha. Libra taska palibadosa. Rebe de brende kibri anda na baho. Rabaluri adose meneha. Ya palibranda baha. Lebrenke balibaha. Lebrada babaya. Ya palabra zongondo brandi briha. Ya palabada balada babrada bazande briha. Ya brende brende bababa bazande na leba. Ya brana bazongondo brana. La brana baba, imrana mazanta la la baba, la braza kontonto bra, ya brende brenda, imamrana ma, ya pale branda bazondo da, ya kabranda bale baba, ya branda da da bazongondo bra da, ya brende brenda bale ba branda baba, ika brende brenda ba 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 bazondo da, rabada branda bangondo brenda, ibrandi brendi apapa, le brandi brendi 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 andoro bazonda, rabako brandi brendi apapa. Le brandi bidi apapa, le bengondo bidi apapa, le bringa brandi bidi apaya pa, ya branda branda bazongondo bidi, ya branda babaya. Lord, reveal unto me, ika branda babaya, le branda bazanda ba, my assignment for this season. Reveal unto me the way that I should go, O God. Reveal unto me my purpose, the reason for my birth, and the reason for me being alive. Lord, reba. Kondo brada ha, i palere badoze mene ha, i kapalere bedengori adaya, la brana mazunde de ha, i kapala brana makondo ruba, la brende balizungo reba ha, i brada babazo manini apaya. In the name of Jesus, la brada bazanka nta la la ba. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. When you discover your purpose, you will not live your life like everybody else. You will not be mixed in the crowd. As a matter of fact, when you discover your purpose and you are convinced as to who you are to be, many people will live your life. The journey to destiny is, is alone. I want to make it says, li kata branda bazende bredeha. Le man branda bazuka pa de brehataya. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. There are three things that God, as we were praying, said to me. I'm going to release it as a declaration unto you. And you can now write it down if you want and declare it over your life for this week. Am I making sense to you? And then I'm going to share with you the word that God laid on my heart for you this morning. Ah, hallelujah. So when we were praying, this is what the Lord said. He says that those who want you to fail and your shame will be disappointed. It sounds very simple, but it's very powerful. He says, so those who want you to fail 
and want your shame, want you to be put to, us, put to shame, they will be disappointed. Hallelujah. Two, he says that I have made you the head and not the tail. Am I making sense? He said, I have made you the head and not the tail. Whoever it, whoever it is that is listening, claim it for your life. Declare it over your life. I'm telling you, you'll be surprised what is going to happen. And three, he says that you will win. I don't know what battles you are confronted with, and I don't know the challenges that you're standing before, but this is the word of the Lord. You will win and walk in victory. Oh, praise God. Let me repeat it. You will what? You will win and you will walk in what? In victory. These three words. These three, 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 three words. Okay? I want you to declare it over your life. The whole of this week. When you wake up in the morning, declare it. In the afternoon, even before you come to pray, declare it. In the evening, before you go to sleep, declare it. Declare it over your children. Declare it over your husband. Declare it over your wives. Declare it over your business. I am telling you, the creative power of God is going to step out of you and begin to create those realities for you to live in. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Oh, praise God. Is someone ready to receive the word that God laid upon my heart this morning when I woke up? If you are ready, give me a thumbs up. I, I always want a thumbs up because I can't see you. So I can't say clap your hands or, or I can't say scream or shout. Just give me a thumbs up. Praise God. Amen. Father, we thank you. We give you praise. Let a reba dosha brandi bri apa zana mrana maha zeke bread de bread he ke pala rabada. I'm gonna be very quick because I have 20 minutes to share this with you, and I pray that you you catch the revelation in here. Amen. So yesterday I was talking to you about Luke chapter 18. All right, Luke chapter 18, and and we we spoke about five things. But this morning when I woke up. Um, the Lord now dropped two things in my spirit from the same parable that I want to share with you. Are you not excited? That just one parable, God is speaking to us in multiple dimensions and it's just mind-blowing and it's amazing. Oh, praise God. Praise God. I pray that the desire for God's word will be your portion. So this morning when I woke up, this is what the Lord, this is what the Lord said to me. This is what the Lord said to me. He said that, he quoted a verse. He said that, and there was a widow, Luke chapter 18 verse 3. That is the first one. Luke chapter 18 verse 3. He says that, and there was a widow in the city. There was a widow in what? In the city. And she came unto him saying, avenge me of my adversary. All right. Now, he says that the city, city, that means that there were laws that governed that city. There is no city without laws. There is no city without rules and regulation. And to further establish the point, there is no need of a judge if there are no laws to enforce in a particular city. So the, the, the law said that there was a law that governed the city. That's why there was a need for a judge. And that's why, the, 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 yeah, that, that was why there was a need for a judge. And then he went on further and told me this. That the woman knew the law. Praise God. The woman knew the law, and in the law, she had a revelation of her rights. Am I making sense? So, it is her knowing the law, and now realizing and discovering her rights, 
that now made her that I made her decide that I am going to go to the law enforcer to enforce the law on my behalf because my right has been trampled upon. Oh, praise God. Hallelujah. Amen. Am I making sense to you? Now, the third thing that he said to me that from the parable, for this woman to be so bold to go to the judge, for the judge to enforce the law for her right, that means that this woman was a law-abiding citizen. Amen? This woman was what? A law-abiding citizen. Hallelujah. Now, in Isaiah chapter 1 verse 17, he says that what? Learn to do well. Seek judgment. Relieve the oppressed. Judge the fatherless. Plead for the widow. Plead for the widow. There was a law in the land specifically designed to cater for widows. And this woman knew the law, knew her rights. So she went to the court of law for the judge to plead a case to the judge, for the judge to make a rule based on the law. Do you know that uh, uh, we have, in the realms of the spirit, we have, we have uh, a legal system. So the, the, the realms of the spirit is legalistic. You understand? It's what? Is legalistic. Do you know that the Bible says that we have the accuser of brethren. He accuses us before God every day and night. Now, how can he accuse us before God if there is no court in the realms of the spirit? Am I making sense to you? So, the devil knows. And he is taking advantage of it. Oh, praise God. Am I making sense to you? So, my question to you is, and this is the question that the Lord plays around. Do you know the law that governs the realms of the spirit? That governs the land? Do you know the law? Now, listen to this. Philippians chapter 3 verse 20 says that our citizenship is of heaven. So, as a citizen of heaven, I, I, I must believe that you will strive to know the laws that governs your kingdom. Because the only way you'll be able to walk in victory is to be a law-abiding citizen. So, if you're a law-abiding citizen, that means that you know your laws and you know your rights in the law. So, do you know Do you know? Do you know your rights as a child of God? Oh, hallelujah. It is because we are ignorant of what the law of God says. And we are ignorant of our rights. The enemy is bombarding us left, right, front, back, center. So we come in prayer and we just do shabalaba, 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 hey, hey, shalaba, ha, ha, shalaba, hey, hey, shalaba, and we leave. But we, we are not based upon the laws that governs the land. The devil prays on our ignorance. The Bible says in Hosea chapter 6 verse, Hosea chapter 4 verse 6, My people are destroyed from lack of knowledge. Because you have rejected knowledge, I, have, I also reject you as my priest. Because you have ignored the law of your God, I will ignore your children. So many of us, we ignore the law of God. And because we have ignored the law of God in the court of law, we have nothing to speak to our defense 
We, have, we, uh, we don't have the articles to refer to and the enemy constantly is making accusations and we are standing there because we don't know our rights. Because we don't know the law. So he is what? He is prevailing against us. Do you know why this widow was so bold, was so brave, was so tenacious? It's because she knew who she was. Do you acknowledge your citizenship? See, many of us in this land, we strive so much to become citizens of America. We, we go through the lens and the breath and do everything. To become citizens of America. Do you know why? Because as a citizen of America, there are some benefits that comes with it. So some of us, we are hurriedly, we, 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 we are, we hurriedly, no, what, what, what I'm looking for? Yeah, yeah, in between you said, ma, we hurriedly forgo of our birthright. What I mean by birthright is that the country of our birth, we let go of our citizenship of that country. Whether it be France, whether it be Paris, whether it be Ghana, whether it be Sierra Leone, whether it be Liberia. Why? Because we have come to understand that the citizenship of America somehow, somehow, comes with a lot of benefits than our own country that we came from or that we were born. So we throw it away and we embrace another country's citizenship because of the benefits that come. Do you know the benefits that come with you as a, with your citizenship of heaven? You don't know. So how is the judge going to rule in your favor if you don't know? I'm spending too much time here. Let me move on. Oh, praise God. See, God being so wise has given us the law of our citizenship. Our constitution. Our constitutional right. There are people who say our constitutional right. We have the constitution of heaven. We have the laws of heaven, which is encapsulated in Genesis through Revelation. Many of us, we do not read the Bible. We can spend 5 hours, 12 hours, 13 hours, 16 hours sitting behind the books, learning for the exams. We can spend hours in lecture halls because we want diplomas, we want certifications, we want PhDs, we want to be certified in a specific area, but the, the law that will grant us victory and put us ahead, we don't like studying. We pick up the Bible to read. In two minutes, we fall asleep. In three minutes, we pick our phone call, phones and we begin to chat. Oh, praise God. The interesting thing is when you come to church and the pastors are preaching to you, you become so bored because you, are, you don't know the value of the words that are being spoken to you. Someone has sat down, like I sat down, compiled notes, studied, drew out points. God spoke to them to come and speak to you. We disrespect them by going through Instagram. Whilst the message is coming, whilst the pastor is preaching, whilst the pastor is teaching, uh, we, are, we are going through Instagram. Instagram. We are liking people's naked pictures. We are liking people's exposed breasts. We are liking a, 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 a fashion that will not bring life to us. <laughs> listen to what listen to what Paul told Timothy. He says that in First Timothy chapter four verse thirteen, till I come, give attendance to reading, to exhortation, and to doctrine. Three. The Bible says that in the end times, uh, many will not endure sound doctrines, uh, but we will rather go for people that will tell us things that will tickle our ears. Uh, we will rather adhere to what? To seducing spirits uh, and doctrine of demons. And that is how come many of us, we are plagued with all kinds of sicknesses and uncleanliness and filth. 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 Give attendance to reading. 
Reading what? Reading the parchments that has been made available. Reading the epistles that we have now in the Bible. Reading the laws that was made available to him. Reading books that were recommended to him by his spiritual father, Paul. Nowadays, we don't endure discipleship anymore. So, when your pastor comes and says that for the whole month we are reading the book of Revelation, you, you, you become rebellious and snobbish, and you don't read the book of Revelation because you think that you have heard from God, so you would rather read Songs of Solomon. But have you forgotten that with every house, there is an angel. For every house, there is a leader. For every house, there is a head. And, and the spiritual head, from, with instructions from above, brings the instruction for our edification, for our instruction, for what? For our, 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 our pruning, for our building up. Ah, libra kataya katabranda bazuta for our own good. Joshua chapter 1 verse 8. He says that this book of law shall not depart out of the mouth. You may say that it was Paul that said it. So Paul was saying something. But Joshua, God himself told Joshua that this book of law shall not depart out of thy mouth. This book of law shall not what? Depart out of thy mouth. How conversant are you with the word of God? How? How conversant are you with the word of God? I think the two things, uh, I'm just going to share one with you today and then tomorrow I will share with you the other. Yeah, I will do it that way. So that it is not too compressed so that you will get it so that you understand. We can talk about everything else but the word of God. Somebody brought an issue. Instead of you now Counseling that person with the word of God, ma, 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 ma. Come and see the kind of worldly and ungodly advice that you are giving to such a person. The woman knew the law of the land, knew her rights. That is how come she was tenacious to go. To the judge and say listen you may not fear god and you may not regard human but i know my rights i know the law and i'm going to persist until you make a declaration i am applauding this woman because she did not give up everything that we need has already been given to us by god Everything we need. Everything we need. Everything we need has already been given to us by God. David said something, and, 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 and it's very unfortunate. We don't like reading. How much more? Studying the word of God. And you know, in this day and age, God has made it so easy and so simple that, that we even conduct Bible studies in church. There are some churches... They meet on Wednesdays for Bible studies. Even that, even that, eh? Christians are so, excuse me to say, so lazy to the point that we don't even want to go. We have even gone to the extent to provide it to you virtually. You can just pick up your phone, go to the church page, YouTube, Facebook, just listen to what is being taught so that you can apply to your life. That one to no, no. You would rather watch Chin Chon Chin, Korea. Eh? You would rather scroll off TikTok and watch unnecessary garbage. And then the interesting thing that, that, that it is, when a problem comes, then you know how to find a pastor. When a problem comes, then you know how to bring yourself to the house of God. <laughs> my time is up i have to go second timothy chapter 2 verse 15 he says that study to show thyself approved unto god those of you that pick up the bible to read because you want a revelation to come and share on facebook this is not it too you can share a revelation on facebook and you are not approved unto god Study to show thyself approved unto God. 
a workman that needed not to be ashamed, rightly dividing the word of truth. Many of us, we are ashamed of our Christianity. So we can boldly profess our faith in the midst of storms. When we are confronted by people that are ignorant, we are not able to stand boldly and tell them what our faith is all about. Why? Because we are ashamed of this gospel. Your prosperity is locked in the gospel. Your deliverance is locked in the gospel. If you can be like this widow and study the laws of God to know the law for yourself and to know your rights, the benefits that comes with your citizenship, the devil will cry. Why? Because now you have risen as a citizen of heaven and you are moving as God wants you to move. May God bless you. May God keep you. May God sustain you. May God empower you. May God shine his face upon you. And may God release a burden on you for you to seek after him every day of your life. God bless you. Father, I thank you. And I give you praise for this opportunity. Bless your people and keep your people in Jesus' name. Tomorrow at 12 noon, we will be back. And I will give you the part two of what God shared with me. Bye-bye.